Hey guys, I'm Yabi and welcome to my YouTube channel. So as you saw from the title, today we are packing to go to Disney World. Disney World. If you don't know me personally, uh, you probably don't know this about me. So let me tell you something about Disney World and my relationship with it. In 2015 to 2016, I did a Disney program where I went to work at Disney World in Florida for a year. Basically since then, uh, Disney has hold a special place in my heart. And this is also where I met Ben, my soon-to-be husband. So it is a very special place to me and I haven't been in three years and we miss it so, so much. So we had the opportunity to go back. I now have a friend who lives in Florida. So we're gonna go visit her for a week, but of course no trip to Florida is complete without a stop at Disney World. So we're going for a very brief amount of time. Uh, we're gonna be there for two days and a half. So basically we're going to Disney World in only a few days and I'm so excited and today we're packing, yay. I've already put everything on my bed that I wanna bring with me. If you've also watched my pack with me for Vancouver video, you know that I am very methodical about how I pack. I like to make lists, make sure I have everything. I've already planned my outfits I wanna wear in the park. I've checked the weather it's honestly, it's changing every day. So I'm gonna plan for as much types of weather as I can. Good news is that it shouldn't be too cold. Although I have been to Florida before in the winter thinking it wasn't gonna be that cold and it got cold. So let's not make the same mistake again and not be prepared for that. Challenges today, we are only bringing our carry-ons. No check-in and luggage because we don't wanna pay for it. And also because I don't wanna waste time having to wait for my luggage at the airport. No time to waste. Everything needs to fit in a carry-on and we're gonna have a, uh, have my backpack. So that's gonna be the challenge. So let's get, let's get packing. So welcome to the bedroom and to the bed where I have laid everything I, I want to bring. So I, I completely understand that not every day, everything here is gonna make it into the carry-on. So this is the carry-on I have. So your regular carry-on, regular sizing. And then I'm gonna have this Lululemon backpack that I love to bring with me when I travel just because it has so many great pockets. And then I might bring, I know I can have like a little handbag as well. So I might bring either this bum bag extra to fit in some extra things or my regular purse. I haven't decided yet, but anyway, what goes in here is like the, like my passport and my wallet and little key items. And like I mentioned, so I'm going to Florida for a full week, but only a few days to Disney. So after uh, Disney, uh, we're going to stay with my friends and we're gonna be working from there. So I do need to bring my work stuff. So this also needs to fit to my backpack. So that's an extra challenge. Everything is laid here, as I told you. Love a Google Keep list, so I have it here on my laptop to help me as I pack. And now let me show you everything I will be packing and wearing for Disney World. Comfort is key, especially we're going to be doing like from opening to closing time park days. We need to be ready for AC places, so air conditioned places that are cold, hot and humid weather, rain, often it's raining in Florida. So you need to be ready for all of this. Comfy shoes, sunscreen, and of course, I don't have a lot of Disney merch, which is kind of surprising considering how much I love Disney. So I'm bringing the few items that I have and I'm hoping to buy a few more. Okay, so let me show you. First thing, what am I gonna wear on the plane? I'm gonna wear some jeans, because also let's remember, it's gonna be like minus something here in Montreal when we leave. So I'm bringing some jeans. These are just regular Levi's jeans that I love, high waist, straight leg, my favorite jeans. I'll be wearing this with a black t-shirt. I have a uh, regular, like an under, no underwire bra that's more comfy. And then I'll be wearing some fuzzy and comfy socks because it's gonna be cold here. I'll be wearing my Columbia, it's like a warm shirt. It's like a technical shirt. And then I'll wear my jean jacket on top of it. This is my jean jacket. That's gonna be like my jacket for the trip, so I'll be wearing that on top of it. This is from American Eagle. Love it, love the oversize. And then in my feet, I'll wear my Converse, so just like regular shoes. And I think that's gonna be good to go for the plane. All right, plane outfit is done. Now we have arrived in Florida. Ah, it is gorgeous weather, hopefully. 
Uh, so we're gonna make our way from the airport to our resort. We're staying at the All Star Music Resort. First stop is Epcot. Uh, okay, a little parenthesis about Disney planning as well. Right now, because of COVID, you need to make a reservation for the parks you want to go to. So the first park you want to go to, because we bought park hopper tickets. So we already know exactly where we're going every day because you need to make a reservation. So the planning is day one, Epcot. Really just touching Epcot. And then we're going to Magic Kingdom for the rest of the day to go see the fireworks at night. On the, maybe I'll come, I'll come talk to you. Day two, Hollywood Studios to Epcot, but it's full, full day. Our third day, we are doing Animal Kingdom Day. So that's our park journey. So now you understand where I'm going. Maybe you'll understand the outfit I'm thinking. Okay, back to the packing. All right, so first day, so we're doing Epcot and Magic Kingdom. So I feel like for this first day, I wanna be as Disney as possible. So I'm wearing the only Disney shirt I have <laughs> to go to this day. So what I'm planning on wearing is my Disney, my mini Disney shirt. And then it's meant to be like 25 degrees. Uh, so I'm hoping I can wear my uh, jeans. So just like black, black jeans to go with it. So these are also Levi's mom jeans. So I think that this with the t-shirt is gonna look super cute, but I know it could be warmer as well. So I would like to bring some shorts just in case it's like super warm and I can't do jeans. So these are just Lululemon shorts super comfortable i like that it has pockets either the shorts or the jeans with my disney t-shirt my mini shirt and then i'll be wearing my mini ears to go with all this and now what i'm hoping is i would love to wear this uh button down shirt however this is quite bulky so i don't know if it's gonna fit in my luggage so if it does awesome if it doesn't i'll just bring my uh, the polar shirt I showed you earlier. So this is gonna be like my warm shirt for the trip. So I can just carry this around if it's cold. And now to be comfy with uh, during the day. So I'm wearing these Nike running shoes and I already have the socks I wanna wear. I have my underwear ready as well, you know me. So just like a regular bra, comfy underwear. And this is what we have for day one day two biggest day from opening to closing time so we want to be as comfy as possible i have meant to wear these biker shorts they are from lululemon and they're like a navy color and what i love about these they have pockets yes because you carry around so much stuff during the day and then one of my favorite t-shirts so it's just like a regular oversized t-shirt that's super super comfy what I want to pair it with to be Disney-y is I have this Monster University hat. So my Monster University hat with like the t-shirt and with the shorts. And then if it's not too warm, right? So it could be a little bit colder. I'm also bringing in just some uh, leggings that I have. So these are also from Lululemon and they also have pockets on the side. There's a pocket in the back. so loads of pockets to make them super useful. So if it's too cold for the shorts, I'll just do the leggings with the t-shirt. I'm gonna wear a sports bra underneath the t-shirt because like I said, I wanna be super comfy through the day and especially if it's warm and you get like sweaty. So I feel like this is a little bit better. So as well from Lululemon. I'm gonna wear, of course, my sneakers. And then I was thinking of wearing more of like a longer, just longer white socks to do like a kind of a sporty, sporty look. And then again, for warmth, it's gonna be my go-to shirt. Maybe my jean jacket could be cute too. So that is outfit for day number two. Day number three, Animal Kingdom Day. So I'll be wearing, so if it's warm, I'm hoping I can bring, I can wear this uh, skirt. So it's this little skirt. So it's shorts underneath. With pockets, this is super, super comfy. Then I would wear it with just like a black t-shirt that is not dirty, okay. So just with a little black t-shirt, this is from American Eagle. This is a Columbia skirt. So it's like sporty cute, you know? And then I can either wear it with my Monsters University's hat or with the mini ears, depending on the mood and the weather. So that would be my ideal outfit with, once again, my running shoes for comfort. And I have prepped here a bra, underwear, and socks. But if it's not warm enough, I 
I'm hoping I could wear these jeans. These are like flare jeans. So I thought these would look really cute with the little t-shirt and with the sneakers. So I'm hoping I can bring these. These are from American Eagle. But if they don't fit, I'll probably wear either the mom jeans that I would wear on my first day or the other jeans I'm wearing with me on the plane. So hopefully I have space for these jeans, but if not, I have two other options. And then same thing for warm, I have my polar. Now, extra things that I'm bringing uh, for the weather. So I will be bringing my rain jacket. So this is my rain jacket that I bring with me everywhere. It is from Frankenoat. And I love that it's long, which is great for raining uh, when it rains in Florida, because sometimes it rains this way instead of raining this way. So you want to be as covered as you can. So I'll bring this with me. What I think I'm going to bring as well. So like I said, I was caught before being in Florida in the winter, not having bring enough warm clothes. So I think I'll bring my like spring coat because it can all fit into this little pocket that doesn't take any space. So just in case I'll take this with me if it's very cold and then I have a beanie uh, and some gloves. So just in case, this is also coming with me. Now I've shown you everything I'll be wearing, but there's a lot of accessories and other things that I bring with me when I go to the parks. First of all, when I go to the parks, I make sure to have like a bag that I can have with me through the day to fit all the essentials that I need. For this trip, I'll be bringing this backpack. So it is a Herschel backpack that I got at Christmas from my sister-in-law, Becky. Thank you so much. And it's like the perfect size for Disney day bag. So what do I put in the bag? I'll need some sunglasses. So I have my favorite Ray-Ban sunglasses that I just have with me all the time. They are very dirty. I need to clean them before we go. I'm gonna need a water bottle, of course, because in Florida, I don't wanna be dehydrated. So now what I don't know is to choose. So I have this water bottle that is insulated and will keep the water cold through the day. Or I have this cute water bottle that is also Toy Story theme. And I love it so much and I kind of feel like weird if I don't bring it. But at the same time, this one will keep my water cold through the day. So I don't really know which one to choose. I'll think on it. So either one of those sunscreen this is my favorite sunscreen it smells good it has little sparkles in it as well oh this is gonna go in the carry-on I'm gonna need to go buy a small sunscreen so <laughs> this is not gonna come with me in the bag I'll have a small one but sunscreen you need sunscreen I'll have with me as well a deodorant some hand sanitizer I'm bringing some masks so these are some black ones that I got at Costco Go check out the Costco haul if you haven't done it already. I will also need my vlogging gear. So my tripod, my mic I'm currently recording with. And then this should fit in my bag. Yes, it does. Perfect. And then of course I have my wallet. I think I got everything I need. So this is what I'm bringing with me for the parks and my park day essentials. All right, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna try to fit everything in my carry-on. I have a few other things I need to put in there just because I'll be staying for an extra week. So I have like a swimsuit, some extra like shorts and t-shirts. So let's see if everything fits in my carry-on. <laughs> This is it guys, we did it. We are all packed, well I am all packed. Uh, so I was able to fit everything I need. So I have my purse that I'll have with me on the flight and my backpack. So in my backpack I have my work essentials in this pocket here and in the main big pocket I have 
all the random stuff that are just not clothes so whether it's like beauty products vlogging gear work stuff is a heavy backpack but everything fits in there and then i have my carry-on Ooh, this is also very heavy that has all my clothes my park essentials pajamas bathing suit you name it everything fit i had to sit on my suitcase to make it fit but doesn't matter everything's in there so i'm all packed also if you wanted to know earlier i didn't know which water bottle to bring i'm going with this one so the one that will keep the water cold i'm being a, an adult here making an adult decision not picking the cute stuff picking the useful stuff <laughs> so this is it for this video thank you for packing with me for Disney World. I'm so excited for my upcoming vacation. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done it already because I have more Disney videos coming your way very soon. Thank you so much for watching and for helping me pack and I wish you all a very good weekend. Bye guys!